creating a dashboard. So log into your Garmin Connect account and what it will do is bring you to the tabs that are associated with your particular dashboards. So you can see uh, you ha uh, have different dashboards that you can rename or delete. Um, what's nice is this is this is important if you are um, somebody who has multiple activities running, swimming, um, cycling. Uh, but you can also just look at health and fitness. So sleep, steps, you can grab these panels at any time and just move them to where you'd like them to go, okay? So by just dragging and dropping these panels. Let's get that moved over, there you go. Clicking on the little it's eight wheel, o'clock uh, will allow you to remove a panel, okay? And you can choose a mini view on some of these panels. Uh, you can go to the full page uh, right from these little wheels, okay? So how do you create a dashboard? Well, you just hit this plus button and you say create dashboard. So what we're going to create our dashboard about today is um, sleep and steps. Okay, so let's go to our dashboard and you can see it's blank. How do you add a panel? This button right here on the left will bring up a whole list of various metrics that you can add. A, a, a tremendous list. <laughs> You know, it, it keeps on scrolling here. Swing analysis, if you're a golfer, weight, workouts, uh, a lot of cool features, okay? So what I'm going to do in this particular case is I'm going to uh, take a look at sleep, okay? If you go into the sleep section, okay, and you scroll up, you'll see add to dashboard. You've got to kind of navigate it if you have a smaller screen, but we hit add a dashboard and it will then place on this particular dashboard of sleep and steps, your sleep. So in this case, we want to now do our um, steps. Okay, so there we go to steps. Do the same sort of thing, add to dashboard, this particular panel, and there you go, you have your steps, okay? Now, remember, the wheel really will tell you a lot about your, your sleep movement, uh, in this case, uh, your mini view, which doesn't really tell you much, uh, but your sleep levels is nice because you can see deep, light, and awake. Okay, grabbing a panel and moving it, you can choose to go vertical or horizontal with your, your panels, okay? So I think that's a nifty feature, uh, especially if you want to look at them side by side. Um, so in this case, what we're going to do is we're going to take a look at our list view for steps matched up with our sleep, okay? And what we want to do is um, it'd be nice if we could uh, sort it, but let's take a look. This was yesterday, which I uh, had 19,000 steps yesterday, and you could see that I slept 8 hours and 10 minutes. Okay, You can modify that, too, if you wanted to confirm it. Okay. All right, uh, so that is, in a nutshell, uh, the dashboard feature of Connect. We'll, we're going to dive into more of uh, how you look at Connect and check out uh, the video on the mobile Connect product, which is great for, for on the go. Thanks for watching.
connects 